listen. <clears throat> listen to the sound imbuing the air and the earthly ground and ringing down in the deep blue sea. The ruby bird calls throughout fantasy. Come, come, he hails as he flies along. Listen. The rainbow cat will sing her song. Like a dancing wave on a stream. Like a tender smile or dream. As the wind carries the melody, a river runs through our fantasy. shades of red and blue? Were you the lucky one to feel her velvet magic touch on you? Are you the one who has been told about the glittering shades of gold, of scarlet, yellow, turquoise, green, and shades that have never been seen and never given their rightful names? Once in a while they swirl like flames and then you'd see a bluish glow with iridescent indigo? No? Have you ever seen the mystic rose? Eternally she's in full bloom. Were you allowed to come so close that you could smell her sweet perfume? Have you beheld the knight so brave rushing towards the dragon's breath? With high-held sword, he's bound to save the princess from a certain death. Have you ever had the chance to look beyond a magic tree and see the fairies magic dance within their land called fantasy? Have you ever seen? Have you ever seen? Have you ever seen? Have you ever been? Have you ever been? Have you ever been to the land, to the land that's never been seen? Have you ever been to the land, to the land of fantasy?
purple waters flow, where trees and flowers grow in soft and magic light. Fantasy, weaver of our dreams, sail on pearly streams, sail into our night and help us understand the magic of this land. Flixie Fox, don't run away! Don't, don't run, run away! away. I need to take a nap. No! <laughs> all right, all right. Hmm. Aha! The story of the innocent. The innocent. The story of the innocent red cat. And the terrible, the mean, Zorok Scream! I can't see. A human girl, joyful and gay, was singing as she walked her way to see a granny in the hood. La 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 la. <laughs> now, Throck's crew of the Grey Wolf Gang, with his horrible, moist poisonous fang in the middle of his ugly snout, disguised himself, left his eyes out. Sneaked in at Granny's to set the trap in order to catch a devoured cat. And then he laughed his mean laugh. <laughs> <laughs> and lay flat. The red cat got the rainbow cat. Yes! No, she didn't. She, she did not. not! But that's a foolish thing to do. From such a nice place, Strox. Why didn't she call the cat? Why? Humans are different. They do not believe in the cat on whom they could rely. Therefore, they will rarely receive the rainbow cat's help. That's too bad. Yeah. I'm so sad. Why can't they see that the rainbow cat is real and true? They live in their world, not in fantasy. They don't see the signs as like we do. We're used to them. Since time of old, we detect them everywhere, like we've been told. High in the mountains and on the ocean wide. Sometimes concealed, sometimes right at your side. A laughing chap. Or just an easy guess. <coughs> with open arms. Or just a slight caress. Sometimes I see a halo in the clouds. Sometimes hear, I hear a voice, but it's never loud. A shadow hard to see, a shimmer in the tree, a flicker in the night. Was it an elf, a sprite, an imp, a goblin, or a fae? Well, my friend, what do you say? It is a cat! You think it's true? The cat exists? Of course we do! Who is the one who will help you out? It's the Rainbow Cat! It's the Rainbow Cat! Who will be there when you have a doubt? It's the Rainbow Cat! It's the Rainbow Cat! When you walk on the road with a heavy, heavy load And you cannot see the end You need a friend! I need a friend! And how? The rainbow cat first comes along As he did so many times before In the sing the rainbow chorus song Your halo is not heavy anymore And you want to see them even more The rainbow cat comes and sing along The rainbow song, sing the rainbow song The rainbow song But one thing he will never do is to carry the way for you. The rainbow song, come and sing along. The rainbow song, sing the rainbow song. The rainbow song, any heavy load. The rainbow song, walk along the Oh,
folks. We're happy, delighted, and glad to have such a wondrous, wonderful friend. No one would stay desperate or sad. There always was a solution in the end. Where does this cat come from? No one knows. It's just like that. She comes and goes. Now, all that glitters is not always gold. For long ago it had been foretold that evil intention conspiracy would creep right to the heart of fantasy. Wavering, quavering parts of mine, come bother my brain, but keep in line. Do not inspire any mistake. Keep Shirkrat or Mughal well awake. Shimmering, glimmering, hope in view. Thinking and guessing and deja vu. Week in, week out without any break. He's just about to bake. Debating, discussing against and for. Brooding, reviewing, and whatever more. Night after night, I stay awake. But instead of solutions, he's got a headache. Stitchy, <laughs> my shifle shade, take note. This is of utmost urgency. And we are all in the same boat. A boat that drifts into emergency. A cause that has shifted, gone off and spun, and something about it has got to be done. Wait, wait! Sounds good! I do agree! Now let's ponder together to find the key. the nature of Shirka, the Mogul, the Brain, and Stitchy, the Helper, the Shy Full Shade. Both are fascinated with planet Earth. Every idea, all that's man-made, is a source of inspiration for them. Well worth considering for an attempt to apply to their homeland, at least, to give it a try. You do think, don't you? <laughs> as hard as you can. Well, that's good. Now tell me about your plan. Plan? What plan? What plan are you talking about? How do you know what the problem is? For <laughs> Pete's sake! Haven't you seen the chaos, the turmoil, the tears and fizz, the pucker, the tempest, the brawl, the upset? I'm talking about the rainbow cat. Oh, of course, of course, the cat. <laughs> well, what, what do you plan to do about that? <laughs> I love cats. I love their velvet fur. And when they start to purr and play with the ball. Enough. <laughs> purr. Not you kitties, the serious stuff. This cat cuts deep into our slice. Each time people see her advice. This cat makes me look ridicule. Me, who's called the great Morghul. And what? Does she say, if she deigns to appear, riddles, suggestions, hints, nothing is clear. It is puzzling sometimes, I have to admit, like bits and pieces that do not fit. A secret code that no one can crack. A trace in the water without a crack. And all are laughing at our expense. Does that ring a bell? Does that make any sense? This cat is only bubble. This cat is like a bug. This cat is only gabble. This cat is like a drug. It gnaws at our governance and undermines the state. It, it nibbles at our dominance until it is too late. An ordinary pussycat is nipping our fight. It's a pain, it's insane, it's a burden for my brain. In other words, it is a shame. How do we cancel our fall? How do we terminate this evil? How do we cancel our fall? It's a pain, it's insane, it's a roller coaster train, in other words, it is a threat. We maintain to complain, there's no profit, there's no gain, in other words, we are upset. 
How do we end all this upheaval? How do we stop it once for all? How do we permanent this evil? How do we cancel our fall? It's a pain, it's insane, it's a burden for my brain, in other words. It is a shame. It's a shame. It's a shame. It's a shame. Closely tailed by the pack of blade. Forever banned from the world of light, they hunt these gems so that their prey might cast a spark into their constant night. And fantasy, the land of dream, is no exception to this rule. The minute one starts to demean, the baneful thread starts to unspool. But for the ones we call naive, who care for their friends in fantasy has always helped. They do believe even when they cannot see. Dear Rainbow Cap, my dog is ill and I am wondering what is wrong. He's so silent and lies still his dog house all day long. Could you please help him? Could you heal my dog? That would be very nice. For you, I'm sure it's not a big deal or you could give me some advice. Maybe sometimes when I'm mad, I yell at him. That's not right. Maybe that's why he's sad and didn't come to say goodnight. When oh, I meet oh. him, he's always there. I think he loves me. He seems to care about my problems, about me. He always listen carefully. Maybe sometimes I'm a bit gruff. Maybe I don't love him enough. Dear Rainbow Cat, I think that's all. Don't forget, Jester is his name. But now I've got to play fly ball. It's the most important game. Isn't it quite amazing to see how hope and trust grows out of grief? How things work out in fantasy? How simple it is with the right belief? Here we see the fearsome four. They are notoriously known to nourish rumors about the door, being a hidden stepping stone to a world beyond good old fantasy. But of course, there is no guarantee. Tell you lads, there's a trick, a hidden lever, or a knob. Maybe a sudden magic flick, a snap, a pop would do the job. <coughs> Whoa! Hey, that's cool, let's do it again. All together, let's count to 10. One, two, three, four, five. Wait, wait, wait. Wait, wait, wait. That makes no sense. That makes no sense. I'm sorry, Valdo. No offense, but honestly, you're right. Counting to 10 is way too Wrong. Talos is right. Talos is right. Let's do something <coughs> new. Let's count like the humans do. Whoa. Whoa. I know how it goes. Listen to me. It goes like that. One, two, three. Ready? One, two. Wait, wait, wait. What happens to four? It doesn't really exist anymore. It does not exist. And five and six. It's not important just for some clicks. And five, and six, and seven, and eight. Excuse me, lads, it's getting late. Could we just make another <coughs> snap, or do you want to take a nap? <coughs> now listen, lads. Everyone is that you follow my command. Eight, nine, ten. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> One. Whoa! How'd you do that? I have no idea. Let's snap our fingers and then we're out of here. The louder the snapping, the better the sound. Come on, folks. Don't just sit around.
children play and they they love it and just like them you can say <laughs> I am the cowgirl of the wild west I am the cowgirl of the wild west and certainly I am one of the best my cowgirl hat fits on my head I won't take it off not even in bed it is important it is my pride and you never know when you have to rise and chase the villain who robbed the bank, leaving the counters empty and blank, galloping now towards the hills. That one, um, no one follows, no one dares, but I will jump on my horse. That one-eyed masked villain has no place to hide. Yeah! <laughs> is not much fun. Come on over with us and play Rainbow Cat. Yippee! <laughs> hey, have you seen my cowgirl hat? Wow. wow! You see, Stitchy, that is how it is done. Oh, I see, Sure Cat, but she's the only one. <laughs> Don't worry. Very soon we'll have what we call a chain reaction. None likes to stand Mom, apart. <laughs> Boy, that's an ape. You're smart. But Stitchy, keep a watchful eye on this cat. We must be cunning and sly. Beware. Self-control and passion. And most discussion. Zipper. <laughs> And not ah, concerned at all by it. spies, by plots, intrigue, or jealousy. <laughs> Flying down from the colored skies, the crystal flakes are on their way with tender moving colored wings. And there's Bawani, the rainbow fade, inspiring news for queens and kings. Oh, no. <laughs> and now, tell me, Pi. Did you like the queen? Have you seen her dress in emerald green? Oh, yes. And you, Sasa, what did you do? I painted the cat in beautiful blue. Yes. Isn't it wonderful? And you, Dilo? I have all the colors to show. What is your favorite color today? This one. <laughs> what is the song of the rainbow fade? Well 
colors I like in red, cobalt blue for my heart, yellow to get really small, orange to help you to grow, and what about indigo, a child that few have seen, the twin of purple and green, these are my children that shine so bright, sleeping together in lean and doesn't work, it doesn't work, it doesn't work at all! It's sluggish, it's tough, it's rough, it's slow. Yes, it's slow. The idea is good. It's wide. The crow like a snail. An untamed river should flow. But it's definitely slow. I know that! <gasps> it's a bird. What I do not know is why and how to neutralize the omnipresent rainbow cat lines. That's hard. She's very good at that. For years, I studied the background of the rainbow cat, the facts, the report, the fantasy, how authorities would strive against the cat. It's still kicking and alive. But they say that cats have nine lives. Oh, oh don't say it. We <laughs> must write the script to the play. People must dance to our rules. They follow the cat. We look like fools. Each time they ask the cat for advice, it means we do not throw the dice. And that will inevitably seal our fall. Oh, no good. No good at all. We should chase it like a filthy rat. I say, let's do it now. Let's kill that cat. We hunt it down with all we can. That's the, that's what we should do. That's the plan. A hunting party from coast to coast. Bank. <laughs> Bank twice. <laughs> that gets a ghost. You cannot trace it, gonna chase it, gonna pin it to the wall, gonna nab it, gonna grab it. Oh no, I've let them in a waterfall. I'm still missing a crucial link. Shifle Shade and Great Bogoon! Zipper! He is about to think! <laughs> Why don't we chat and play it cool? Oh, give your fuming, hard working brain a rest. I can help you to obtain what you so desperately seek if we combine. Why would you do that? What's in for you? Well, let's say your interests are mine. <laughs> oh, well, in that case, how do you do? <laughs> hey, we're lucky. He's the one we need. She's got that thing. What do you mean? Sure, cat has failed. <laughs> Indeed. You've put the cart before the horse. You should follow the lead back upstream. Get things moving right at the source. That's where the key lies for you. Scheme sneak up there and put on the lid. Sure, Cat, that's something we never did. Don't try to repair where the damage is done. 
Beat off the attack. Beat off the attack before it has begun. Catch your enemy by surprise. Oh, present a dummy <laughs> in deceptive guise and you have a perfectly working plot. Oh, I like that. I like that a lot. So, the essence of your advice is to chase the cat and leave the mice. I got it. It's as simple as that. We deny the existence of the cat. We convince everyone with all we can. Yes, we deny it. That's the plan. We do not deny it. We encourage, support any rumor, any hearsay, any report of any appearance. We say, it is real. That's how we recapture command of the wheel. Ooh, that's risky business. That might knock us flat. Not if this cat becomes a hat. A hat? A hat, my friends, is what we've got. A shiny symbol of the state. A hat gives us our dignity. But wait, there's something else to learn. And so we use it as a bait. A hat will give your teeth. But wait, there is another turn. This hat must be a goal to reach every day throughout the year. If we establish what to teach, the cat will disappear. A mastermind, a ghost out of a bottle, a golden fish. Whatever it takes to fulfill his wish. The cat is eager to reply to an honest demand, to an urgent need. The cat is here, and so am I. Only I deal with selfishness and greed. What is a leader, a chief, a king, anyone? who looks for the real true thing, a solution, a sign, a real true guide, and doesn't see the cat at his side. citizens of fantasy, come gather on this glorious day which has given rise to the latest decree of Shere Khan, the Great Magool. Hooray! 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 Sure. <laughs> but first, let me express our thanks that go to the finest of our ranks. For countless days and many a night, he, uh, he shimmered to hope and despair. For countless endeavor and many a fight, he troubles for our welfare. No wrinkle that will not pledge the truth, no waking bone, no gray hair. He sacrificed his health and youth to tend to any affair. Oh, Magoo, oh, could I be just like you, a leader so tender, a poet, philosopher, a manichu, 
a liar and a cheat. <laughs> <laughs> oh, sheer Tartar's thanks in an endless flow, addressing you night and day. Hooray for sheer Khan, we say. Hooray! 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 As I say each day to myself, Buddy, you are just a book on the endless shelf of Cosmo's eternal library. I'm not finished yet. A small chapter on Destiny's own diary. Right now we have some astonishing news. News that may trouble you and confuse. Decades of research of a very small crew have finally brought scientific breakthrough. Professor Schnudelwitz. Schnudelwitz? Schnudelwitz? Yes, wait and see with your very own eyes. <laughs> this is all the brain for this is my life. <laughs> we all know you have spared no expense, but for us, it doesn't make any sense. But this is the proof! All the details are here! <laughs> but Professor, for all of us, this is not very clear. Oh! <laughs> This is grave. 
My dear friends, we must be brave and face the consequences of that. Who would have thought the rainbow kept is a hat? Yes, but a very beautiful hat. All those visions throughout all those years. A little malfunction of our ears, uh, uh, our eyes. <laughs> too generous and way too vast for an arrogant magool to bewitch it. He cast a spell upon 
it that could last. But you and the others accepted his hat. Oh, and wasn't it a lot of fun? We need a hat, a hat. We need a hat for all and chase the past away. We need a hat, a hat, a bulky or a small for a better world today. But does that discard the rainbow cat? Could the moon ever outshine the sun? Could the silly world interrupt the flow of an inspiring, fascinating tale? A wall to erect, a stone to throw, each effort will be to no avail. If... <coughs> you believe in your magical wings that lift you up without any weight, as close as to catch the magical rings of the colorful rainbow, the mysterious gate.
been to the land, to the land of fantasy. Have you ever seen, have you ever seen all the land, all the land lying in between? Have you ever seen all the land, all the land of fantasy?